What's up guys, it's Gadget Green Chitty here and in this video I got you guys a tutorial on how to flash and install AOKP on your Google Nexus 4. So the first thing that we are going to do is we are going to go in our browser and go to the Nexus 4 original Android development on the XDA developers website. Now we are going to look through this and find a OKP 4.2.1 Mako builds. Okay, so now that we are here, we are going to scroll down to the downloads and to get this to work, we are going to need the G apps and also the ROM itself. So we are going to download both of these. Just click the link and hit download for both of them and save them to your download section. And that that will actually be where it saves the ROM and Google Apps at default. So you guys don't really have to worry about that. So once you get those downloaded, what we're going to do is we are going to go and download ROM Manager from the Play Store. And if you already have that, that is great. So once we got that downloaded, we are going to go into RAW Manager, Flash, uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery, and then boot into Recovery Mode. So we're going to to RAW Manager and Flash Clockwork Mod Recovery, and then if you haven't, and then we are going to reboot into Recovery Mode. Grant super user permissions, and we are going into recovery mode. Now, while this is booting up, I'm going to show you guys how to actually operate Clockwork Mod. So, to go down, you're going to hit the volume marker down, and to go up, you're going to hit the volume marker up. And then to select something, you're just going to hit the power button. So, you guys can hold this up here. And the first thing that we are going to do is we're going to wave our data and factory reset so we're gonna go up to yes then we're going to wipe our cache and now we are just going to go to install zip from SD card choose zip from SD card and then we're going to hit O and then the slash and we are going to go down to our downloads and find the hold on mine might be in a different place. So yeah, it'll be in your uh, downloads if you download it straight from there. But if you download it from the Goo Ma Goo Manager app, it'll be in Goo Manager. So you're just gonna go to downloads, find the AOKP underscore Mako, um, whatever build, and then you're going to download it. And then we are going to go back to choose it from SD card slot zero and then go to downloads and G apps. Okay, now what we're going to do is we are going to hit go back and then reboot system now. This may take a while, so don't get worried if it takes. Oh well, so I'm just going to fast forward through this right here. And it's done, so we have successfully flashed MKP, and I'm just going to fly right through all of this. So we're going to go to settings just to show you real quick about phone. And we got AOKP version right there. You guys can see that. AOKP Android Open King project. So I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Be sure to check out my ROM reviews, my paranoid Android ROM videos, and stay tuned for an overview 
of this ROM. So I want to thank you guys for watching one more time, and I will catch you guys in the next video.